that's the, that's the thing. When, when you live in the city, we don't really see the stars, right? Now, I grew up in the farm, way up in the north, and we could see incredible stars at night, and so lots of times you'd see a falling star. It's a really cool experience, so it just comes, and you're supposed to make a wish, right, when you see a falling star, because then your wish comes true. So, so in this piece, um, it says shooting stars in summer, so I think that's kind of what it's, it's about on this beautiful night, and you're, you're out looking at all the stars, if you can imagine that, right? And it sets up this really, really pretty mood on that. The music is very beautiful. Um, so I think it's here that I think this is the star poem. I think that's the star. So um, just in, in, in what I hear in my, my own ear. So if you can make that feeling like that, it's very smooth in that part. And, and we feel the star falling from the sky, right? Um, so let's do the beginning. Maybe we can just make it, <coughs> it says with wonders, right? So, so very, very legato, very flowing. I always call them uh, railroad tracks, you know, train tracks. So when you get to the train, what do you do? You sort of stop and look both ways, right? See, so make sure there's nothing coming. So, so that means a stop. So when you do, um, make sure there's no trains, right? And then you go on, right? So it's just a lift off. You have that, for example, again, at the, uh, right at the end, of it. like there's both hands, right, where your trains come off, and then, then you don't hurry, okay? Um, yeah, one thing you should work on always is just making sure that your counting is always secure so that you, you don't leave out any beats, right? So sometimes you have to just make sure you count, like, if you're one, two, three, off, there's another one, right, where the thing comes up, right? Uh, one more time. See, this one, like, it's a little bit longer before you come in on the first beat. I'm, I'm going to give, tell you what to do, okay? Yeah. So just you have to watch that because you're a little bit too soon on that part. Okay, but let's go on there. Just right there. From the, from the G sharp. Yeah. starts up again and it's really beautiful. Okay. Can we do can you go right on this chord from the It's just like, you know, if you, if you learn to walk and chew gum at the same time and you have to be coordinated. So, uh, so you just have to think, you can make your left hand do something different than your right hand. 
Good. So, um, can we just go from here?
So from the so I want you to think smooth through your hand. That's better. That's going to be the, the high point. So we want to feel like you're going to grow to that, and then, and then it softens off, and then it comes back again, right? Okay? So um, one more time. Just so we're, we're just going to really keep that continuing feeling through the phrases. Yeah, this is a little bit like what I was saying to Lily, in that the left hand passes over to the right hand, back to the left hand. And what you want to feel is that it's it's like you know I don't know if you guys do any track and field but you know if you're running a relay race and and you run and, and you pass the baton on I used to run when I was a younger so um, so you pass the baton on and then that person takes it and it it goes really smoothly sometimes if you watch a race say in the Olympics or something somebody will drop the baton and then everything gets fouled up right. So it's thinking when you go from your left hand to the right hand, you take it gracefully and then you take it back again. You just pass it back and forth, right? So it's really smooth. Can we do it one more time? So now we're getting getting the feeling. Let's just go on, keep going to the next bit. Sorry, that was a, kind of a bad place to start. I didn't. That wasn't very good. Let's just try. It. Let's start up there. That'll be easier to start. With. That's more the feeling, right? I want you to really think of that smooth, graceful feeling. Yeah. And so you, I want your leg to be just perfectly like, like, you know, uh, like glass, right? And, um, and take your, always feel like you're rushing. When you're not rushing, you can take the breaths when you need the phrases. Good, very good. Okay, I think we're ready for some River City Blues.
curvy over here. Okay. So, just, yeah, that's right. I'm trying to just let your hand go through the notes over here, but uh, and you can because it's got a lot on it, so I think you can you know, just hold it and let it die off. Good, good. Okay, so the, like the big thing I think in this piece for you is to really keep the the rhythmic feeling to give the what's called the bluesy swing. Now, so it's always alternating between the dee da da dee da dee da da that sort of that triplet rhythm, and that's what we want to keep really steady. So, um, but it's a lot, lots of fun, and uh, and you you want to just give us the feeling that you're really having a good time when you're playing, right? So let's go from the beginning one more time, okay?
uh, all the way through, right? And the never failing panic, like, so there are some sections that are a little bit tricky where you have to just work it out with your hands so you can keep control. Always practice it slower if it helps. And it's good to, uh, I'm sure you do this, but do it with the metronome and just keep the, the steady feeling of the beat. And always, like, keep your triplets going in that ya pa ta di pa ta di pa. But when you get to the syncopation, then don't, don't feel rushed on that. Okay, good, very good. So we'll slightly change the program. Uh, we'll我们稍微改变一下那个节目我们会有Crystal先来两首曲子比较难的曲子让大家醒一下哈快要睡着了是不是 <笑> 他很小的时候跟我开始学的，后来回去中国，然后暑假来的时候再跟我练习，跟再跟我上课。呀，他接着紧接着在下个礼拜就要考，就要考试了，九级的钢琴。Okay，which okay. piece are you gonna play? Hello, I'm my name is Crystal, and I'm 11 years old. I have been playing piano for five years. Okay. Today I'm going to perform. Under the sunlight by Wang Shanli and Sonata and F major by Mozart. <coughs> 各位嘉宾们,大家好,我叫庄金,今年十一岁了,我学钢琴有五年了,今天我要演奏的曲目是,Wang 
um, yeah, this piece is really, it's about rhythmic energy, I think, more than anything. So it's really keeping the, the rhythm really steady and keeping the energy going all the way through. Um, just a few things I'd like to point out here. So we'll just go back and do a little bit of this, okay? So um, every time you go over into the left hand, if you can make that the crossover like sound really, really strong, because that, that you want to emphasize those things, right? Uh, we'll point that when we get to it. So let's just go from the beginning. Maybe from this. 